With new video giving us a sobering look at the damage from Hurricane Milton. Take a look at Tropicana Field Stadium in St. Petersburg after Milton's winds blew the entire roof off. The stadium, which is home of the Tampa Bay Rays, was going to be used as a base camp for first responders. Milton made landfall overnight as a Category 3 storm near Sarasota, and authorities and residents are starting to assess the damage. The storm surge was so powerful, it washed boats ashore up and down the coastline. So far, five deaths have been blamed on the storm and authorities warn the danger is not over. An estimated 11 million people still face the risk of flooding. As you survey damage and clean up, please be cautious of hazards. We have post-storm fatalities almost every storm, and a lot of these fatalities are avoidable. So please be cautious of down power lines. Governor Ron DeSantis said the state avoided the worst case scenario, but the, he cautioned that the damage is still significant. You are right here looking at a construction crane that toppled onto a building in St. Petersburg overnight. So let's check in with Ashley Ruiz. Ashley, the storm has now moved into the Atlantic. Right, so now it's a post-tropical cyclone, but it still has hurricane force winds of 75 miles per hour. So it's still holding itself together, but it lost those tropical characteristics. And so now it's just essentially an area of low pressure with some pretty significant wind at the moment. Thankfully, it is open over open water now. Again, winds of 75 miles per hour. It's gradually going to weaken, and then it's just going to accelerate off to sea. 